Every day, firefighters put on gear weighing nearly 25 pounds. And when it's a fire they're responding to, add a 25 pound air tank. The gear alone makes this job challenging, but have you ever thought about the other obstacles these men and women face? But, uh, due to the economy and stuff, you never know what type of call you're going to go on. Citywide, the Reno Fire Department responds to nearly 100 calls a day. And since they are an all-risk organization, they see everything from man-made to natural emergencies. One high-risk scenario emergency personnel face is fighting structure fires. And while it may seem as simple as shooting water from a hose, Firefighters have to plan for copious amounts of smoke and extreme heat from the flames. Sometimes they even face the challenge of breaking into a building in order to rescue victims. Motor vehicle accidents are emergencies seen every day in the Truckee Meadows, and extricating victims is no easy task. It is a physically demanding job. Um, the, very, the variation of skills that we are required to perform on a daily basis are incredible. And while medical emergencies are lower risk than a structure fire, they account for 76% of calls the Reno Fire Department responds to. EMS is our primary response. That's because everything we do is about uh, life safety. Responding to over 37,000 calls a year can be difficult, and Reno fire officials say it's more than their tools that help them in emergencies. The diversity of the calls that we go on uh, requires a lot of flexibility, but number one thing it requires is teamwork. In Reno, I'm Alexandria Camito reporting.